Welcome back to another episode of The Preacher's Daughter. Good morning to everybody, all the new sub babies. I'm so proud of you all for getting us to 3K. Like, we just hit the 1K goal. And less than a month later, we're hitting 3K. I just like, I love it so much. And I want to give back to y'all. So please, please go ahead Submit your entry for the giveaway that I'm doing. The due date is the 21st. You still have time. All the entries are free. So tell a friend to tell a friend and y'all both might win. Today, I just want to get straight into the gameplay. Today, we will be seeing if Samani will be able to graduate early. She has gotten her grades up, submitted all of her work before the semester ended. And as y'all know, it is technically winter break. So we'll see if she'll be able to graduate early because technically she wouldn't be graduating until summertime. So yeah, y'all did say in the comments that y'all wanted her to graduate so that we can get her medical school started. And I think that's a great idea because why not? We will be having Jerome visit his mistress because they got a little bit more to talk about. It's been a little minute, so I think we should go ahead and do that in this episode as well. But first, we're going to get somebody situated with her school things. So let's get right into it, y'all. She's in her room. Um, I think we're going to have her come in the living room because, y'all, the computer's been glitching. Like, they've been causing us to like get the game crashes and i don't like that at all so i'm going to use the laptop because we ain't been having issues with that let's go ahead and have her see if she can press graduate early right here yes it says she has the option we're gonna press that and then we also need to have mom pay those bills because girl they almost died because they didn't pay their bills <laughs> So we're going to have her go ahead and do that while we have some money register to graduate early. So are you sure graduating early will mean some money will no longer be a student? They will be able to get a head start in an early career, but will not get to attend the graduation ceremony. That is okay with her. So let's press OK. okay. All right, so it says that she's an early graduate. Congratulations, Samani has graduated high school early. She has shown such exemplary academics and extracurriculars that she earned a diploma while being a teen. Graduating early means that Samani may begin a career earlier and get a head start for professional growth if she chooses to. Yes, that's exactly what we want. So let's see if we can go ahead and start our journey i think it might be under career and let's see find a job somebody has graduated early congratulations while the high school journey may be over when somebody ages up she can enjoy some performance boost for being such an overachiever yes okay now let's see if the option is there for us no it looks like it's not yeah okay so in order for her to become a medical student with the mod that i have we have to age her up but we're going to still consider her as a teenager she's still going to be 18 years old but in the game is going to look at her as a young adult because technically we have to have her as a young adult in order to enroll in that college course so let's go ahead and age her up with a cheat hopefully you don't take off none of her stuff okay and it took away her aspiration i didn't like that i want i love that aspiration i wanted to keep that but um we can always change this so if y'all want to do a different aspiration we can definitely do that but right now i'm just going to put it under a knowledge um let me turn this g shade on it says this sim wants to attend university and get a job and most importantly learn so I guess we can go with that, even though that's not really her passion. That's just the passion that she has to portray to, you know, to others. So we'll just go with that for now. Ooh, now her getting thicker. Okay. What's wrong with your stomach, boo? She's cramping. Okay, we might have to get her some pills if we don't have none. You know pills in your mother room? Yeah, we're going to have to get some pills. But, 
Okay, now that we have aged her up, we're going to have her sit back down. And then go back under career. Find a job. And here it is, health sciences student. You may have heard you can just walk up to a hospital and get a job operating on people, but becoming a doctor or veteran, veterinarian through this career will take years of study. You won't get paid until you graduate and taking exams will cost you money, but persevere and you could further your training as a paid medical or veterinary resident. And from there, become a physician at the hospital or one day strike out on your own with a private vet clinic. This, I love this so much. If y'all wanna know, this mod is by Sim Realist. I'm pretty sure you have to look into what it's called exactly, but that's who it's by. So I'm pretty sure once you look up their website, everything will be there. Let's go ahead and accept this opportunity. Like it said, we're not getting paid at all. We'll have to go to school on Monday through Friday from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. And on Sundays, we'll have to come to church and do everything that we have to do with that. So during the times that Samani is at school, hopefully it'll be like an active career to where we can actually go with her. But if not, we'll figure out what we are going to do during those times in the comments. Let me know what y'all think. You know, we're going to see how it's going to play out, though, because I'm pretty sure we can go on Monday. Today is Saturday. Mm. Yeah, I didn't think that through. But luckily, we are able to do this. And then we also have a promotion task and a daily task that we can do. Let's go ahead and have our browse in Pedia. And it also says she has to pass a health sciences exam. So it's... It says open the career phone menu, blah, blah, blah. Open the career phone menu and choose a 10 health sciences exam to take the exam when you think you're ready. Okay. So she has to do that three times. Okay, where is career? Let's see. I think it's right here under here. How many times she got a browse in PDF for it to be complete? Four times? Uh oh, it looks like Nayara is here. Oh, so it's twelve fifty to do each exam. We gonna have her do that. We gonna just say her parents pay for it because you know they got it like that. I guess. Uh, let's have her browse in Pedia a few more times so that we can complete that task. And then I think her mama did pay the bills and she just standing outside. Girl, come inside. Nayara's outside. We gonna let her in. Uh, we can have her invite her in. And then, Mama, you can come and use the bathroom. And possibly get some rice, because I think she got some rice in here. Yes. So, Mani, how much longer do you have? Okay, that task is complete. Yes. Okay, good. She got a lot of good buffs. She's just... Not feeling good as far as the cramps. But I think she invited Nayara in, but she's leaving. So that's good because we got to go ahead and get that exam done real quick. Jerome is studying to be the best pastor that he can be. Let's hope that's where he actually is. But um, where is it under here? Attend health sciences exam. Hopefully she changed her clothes. Okay, good. So she gonna go ahead and do that And while she does that We'll have her mama come in Check on her plants Do you have anything that you can harvest? Yes, come and harvest everything After you finish eating, obviously 12.50 just like that Your parents just got it like that Excuse my voice, y'all Because I definitely lost it I work in a warehouse and it's so loud And I've been working so, so much Like, I even got to work today like, they got me on mandatory overtime, but I know y'all probably don't care, but that's the reason why I be so fucking busy, and I'm not able to put as much content out, but y'all, I love playing my game, so I want to be able to put out content as much as I can. So, it looks like she got some hollies. Is this some over here? Oh, she can water these. Uh-huh. And what about these? Okay. 
So she's watering that. And now let's see, is she having any other moodless? She's happy. Good for you. We're going to have her drink a glass of wine. She can do whatever she wants. She grown. And ain't nobody home besides baby boy. He not going to tell. <laughs> but he do got to use the bathroom. He trying to watch these cartoons, not caring about his health. Go use the bathroom, baby. They still putting up the decorations and everything from Christmas. Oh, it looks like somebody passed her exam. It says success girl. Yes, she passed her exam. There may be some classwork still to finish, but they are now ready to graduate to the next level when their performance is high enough. Uh-uh. Where you going? Yeah, no. So now that Samani passed her exam, we're going to have her text her man, let him know what's going on, because obviously she wants him to Shopping. know. Um, oh, I forgot. You got to use the phone to text people now. Oh. oh, Hassan is wondering if I want to go over to his house and hang out. Oh, he already knew the timing. We're going to accept, but I think we might have them go somewhere else to celebrate, like a restaurant. Instead of having us travel all the way to his house, we're going to cancel this. And then we're going to just have somebody travel in her car. Because, yeah, why not? Where your car at, girl? Over here. Okay. So, come in. Run out here, somebody, so that you can leave with Hassan. And where are we going to have him go? Let's see. I'm going I'm to look at my ultimate world map because I got a list of everywhere that I got placed down. Let's see. All right, y'all. So we decided to come to the J spot. This lot is by Alexis Ariel. I'm pretty sure I can correct myself. If I'm wrong after I edit this video. But yeah, so this is where they came to celebrate. She let him know that she passed her exam and she's now a medical student. And even though, you know, she this wasn't her biggest plan, she knows this is going to be best for her as far as her getting out of her parents' house and building her own life. So that's why she invited him here to share that experience with her. So we're going to have them come and have a drink, possibly do a little hookah. Um, I can make this place a restaurant for another time. But right now, I didn't have the time to create the restaurant and put down the foods or whatever. But next time, next time. So yeah, let's stop this animation real quick. Because they, oh, not Koda saying, do you want to hang out tonight? Coda, not tonight, but that would have been really nice because of what's going on, you know. Maybe we'll see, but we didn't want to do too much because we did want to have some time to visit the mistress. So let's have them come and sit here. That way, we'll be able to order a drink, possibly get her. Ooh, they got a martini with an olive. They got shots. Ooh, let's get her a strawberry margarita. Buma, yes. Bonji. And then I think I do have to put some Wi-Fi in here real quick. Okay, so the music should start playing. Yes, yes. Ooh, she can talk about marriage with him. I don't know if we're ready for that. Let's um have a deep conversation with him. Let him know about our dreams and stuff and how we still going to pursue being a nail tech. Yes, look at her drink, y'all. Yes. Oh. Yes, you like it? 
trying to get some screenshots. Yes, I love this G-shape so much. It looks so good, y'all. They enjoying themselves, talking a little bit. She's like head over heels on him, and I hope he not playing her, y'all. Cause like, as y'all seen from the beginning, he got some baggage too. Oh, look at that. So let's have them go outside. Oh, what he about to do now? Compliment her. That's so cute. Okay, I think they might be able to come and sit here. Sit and chat here. She's loving the cocktail. Is she drunk? How she drunk off of one drink? Yeah, she a lightweight. But let's see if they're gonna go and sit down over there so that she can try the hookah. Samani, it was one drink, girl. She fucked up. <laughs> But yes, let's see if we can go ahead and yes, put some weed in here. We got some OG Kush. And since they outside, we should be good. Okay, period. Look at it, y'all. Yes. Yes. Oh yeah, she high. Oh yeah, she feeling real good. Look at her, she look real good too, y'all. Look at her. I decided to put her on something sexy because like, why not? Oh, where you going, Hassan? Cause you got her feeling a little too good. Don't leave her by herself. Is he leaving? Is it because it's getting late? Yeah, no. Fuck you mean goodbye. Goodbye, my ass. You're not going nowhere. Add him to the group. Yeah, where you thought you was going? <laughs> we ain't done with you yet. She's stoned as fuck. Come on, Hassan. She probably gonna be getting hungry soon, so we probably can order some food from the bar. But where you thought you was going? She feeling too good. You thought you was finna go? You thought you was finna go? Let's see. Can we... Let's go ahead and kiss his cheek. Oh, he want to sit over there. Come, Come sit over here then. Oh, he got to use the bathroom? Okay, cool, cool. Let him go to the bathroom. We going to go and order her something to eat because she going to be getting hungry soon. Uh, What they got here? Order food. Ooh, we can do some fish. Some fries. Let's do her a meat and cheese platter. And we might have them play a game of pool too. Yeah, she loves R&B. Yes, can we get a meat and cheese platter, please? Okay, actually, we gonna grab this platter. Did she put it in her inventory? Girl, you threw that shit away? Hell no. Give us our fucking money back. <laughs> Order that shit again. 
Because that was $90. Yeah, we just gonna get the single meat and cheese platter. Okay, that's ten dollars. Okay, good. Let's have him flirt a little bit, cause she feeling real flirty. Did the drink wear off a little bit? Okay, yeah, she a little tipsy. Elsa tips to do. <laughs> yes, fill that stomach up a little bit, Solani. And you got church in the morning, girl. Golly, yeah. We're gonna have them play a little pool. And then we're gonna have some money head home. But I think this date was successful. Not y'all coming by in the bar. Just go. Thank you. Okay, so they finna play poor. Yes. They put drool. Wagaborn deep now. Kotlinka. Yeah. Sweet Panta? Sweet Shay. Porpa? Xay. Sneezy. Ibada wig. Ob. Soba Harfish. They is so cute. <laughs> that is. Oh, Moosh Bepso. Watch Anoy. Nazi. Utopia snap with this mod, y'all. I like. I'm loving playing my game. I don't want to stop. I feel like this video is going to be pretty long, so I'm not going to be able to get it out as quickly, but I'm going to try to edit it as quickly as possible. Oh, he got the red ball. So, oh, he got the orange ball? It looked like he put the red ball in first. Okay, he missed. Your turn, some money. Oh my god, she made it and I missed it. Okay, she missed that one. Let's see. Ooh, he might win. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Look how he looking. She said, ooh. Okay, you won that one. She like, I'm gonna beat you next time, though. For sure. Yes, I love that. I'm sorry, that was just so fucking cute. So, is they finna play again? Oh, she said, I was going to say, she said, run it back. Okay, so this is where we going to end this date at. So I'm going to have them head home. She lit. We're going to have him drive her home because we don't need her driving. But I'm going to see y'all when we get back to the house. So Samani finally made it home. We about to have her go use the bathroom. And wash her hands and stuff so that she can smell oh she probably needs to take a shower too she came in and i didn't even see her like was she disappeared or something okay before she go out there she gonna need to take a shower because we know she probably smell like liquor and we And then we're going to have her come in the pantry and get some snacks for her munchies. Let's see. What's she going to want? Um, Let's have her get some Doritos, I guess. Because I don't see nothing else in here. Okay. It looks like she's sobered up. So that's good. You know when you about to start your period, you, you want to munch on whatever you can. Like, you go eat all the snacks that you want 
So that's what she doing. Um, I don't know why she right in front of her dad, but it looks like the weed wore off after that shower. So that's real good. But we about to have Jerome step out, come next door because he needs to talk to this lady over here. So let's sneak here. Oh. Samani, <laughs> act like you're not even paying attention to him. Yeah. Act like he texted oh. Hassan. And he think he's slick. But you see him. Yeah. You see him, girl. Mm-hmm. Look at him. He just like, he a mess. <laughs> okay. Now break in. Visit. <laughs> I'm dead. It said break in. Okay, so we about to go ahead and have a conversation with Stephanie. And we finna see how it's gonna go because we didn't ask any details. Like, there's so many interactions that we could do and I'm ready to get into it. So, yeah, we're finally here. We loaded in, okay? And then we can knock on the door again because she didn't answer. It is late, but it is what it is. Okay, it says he's sad. He has a horrible feeling that something is quite, isn't quite right with his child. Oh my God, leave that alone. You worry about the wrong things. Is he pregnant or is she? Like, what the fuck? His ass look pregnant as fuck. But, okay, she's here. We got her all situated in her PJs. I love this setting. It's like, it's giving realism. But... That's besides the point. We came here to talk to you about this baby girl because you're getting pretty big. Not going to lie. So let's go ahead and ask her about the pregnancy. See if we can get any buffs. And we're also going to share our worries about the pregnancy. We sit in a row. Yeah. Oh, Gosha. I'm going to see. Can we turn on some music? No, be. Yeah, boo. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. Rinka Shalbo. Spobani. Jessene. Mm-hmm. Nerkska Sharag. Nice of you to ask. I'm in my second trimester. I'm happy that I'm going to have a child. Pregnancy has its good days and bad days. But overall, it's a beautiful experience. Oh, wow. Is it? Is it a beautiful experience? Okay. Let's go ahead and organize to provide for the baby. We're going to let her know that we're going to be paying for everything and to keep her quiet. I think we're going to try to give her an amount. And we'll see if she negotiates that amount because she might want more. But I'm thinking maybe $1,000 a month. Or maybe five hundred dollars a week. She might want more, but we'll see. But we already given her rent ten dollars a week, so that's forty dollars a month. Like she ain't paying shit. I think, or actually fifty dollars a month. So she basically just paying for the damn we energies. Okay, let's go ahead and talk about paternity testing. We can ask her to do a paternity test, and we can question being the father. Let's go ahead and do that, because he could be unsure. Like we said, we don't know. Even though we know, but, like, we still can ask that question. Where are you going? We not done with you? Come back. That was rude. Yeah, we about to question being the father because Jerome still got his doubts. So he gonna talk to her about it. Come sit down. Contemplate life. Yeah, I bet you are. Why does Jerome feel this way? Why has life taken such a negative turn? Yeah, you don't like what you hear, do you? 
Moochie peachy. Did he say it? Right. Did he question being a father? Because I need to see. And we're going to see what she thinking too. We got to need, we need to see her buffs. Midlife crisis. This conversation is seeming a little too positive. Is there an issue asking that question? That interaction is not working, but let's see. Does she got any buffs? She likes him. It says likes the sim nearby. So there's no buffs that I see, which normally there are buffs with these things, but that's okay. Um, We gonna see, does she have anything that she can say? She can go to early parenthood classes, birth classes, go buy something for the baby, all of those things with this mod. Let's see what she can say back to him though. Let's ask Jerome if he yeah, even wants kids. Oh, Moosh Pepso. Bon and Gravy? <laughs> oh, yes. Let's also Shepard ask him hey, Finn. to organize yeah, the paper for the baby. <laughs> I'd be all right with having a child. I'd also be all right with not having a child. Okay. That's mixed emotions on that. Flume. Apala Chaba. This Mikos Karenzi. Funchil Bratsa. Bapam. Okay, and then let's enthuse about the pregnancy. And let them know, like, yeah, we can do $500 a week. $500 a week sounds about right. So we're going to have to be on the payroll with her, giving her money. So I think I'm going to make her a bank account so we can send her money easily. One G. Okay, so I open her check as account, so then when we do send her money, it'll go there. Okay, so since they're not getting no buffs or nothing, we're going to have her go ahead and change her outfit, because we're going to go in, get that paternity test done. We're going to have her come in the room and get dressed, because Jerome, like, I need you to come to room me. So that's what she's doing. And when she does, she's going to come back out. Okay, so she's ready. I don't know why this is on here. Okay. All right, so let's go. We about to go ahead and head out. Bina Flim. <laughs> Let's go and get that paternity test done. Get it over with. We might as well just get it over with so that we can find out and make sure that this is my baby before I start giving you money. I know it's pretty early, but we're going to go right away as soon as they open up. Oh, we should have took their truck. That would have been cute. But yeah, they thinking Jerome probably going to work on some studying the whole time. They're going to get this paternity test done. So, y'all, I was going to leave y'all on a cliffhanger, but I can't do y'all like that. So, let's see what came back as the results, y'all. He looks upset. He looks upset. Look at his face. What y'all think? She, she all happy and shit. What the fuck you so happy about? I really want to know. I want to leave y'all on a cliffhanger so bad, but I ain't going to do it to y'all. Let's see what it says. The results are in. It says that he is tense because there's a tragedy. Jerome hoped so badly that the child was not his, only to have to face the truth. Oh my God. Oh my God, I read that so fucking wrong. Only to have the truth slap him in the face. Yeah, it's real, Jerome. That's your motherfucking baby, nigga. <laughs> Let's see what she thinking because she happy as fuck. Tell you reject Stephanie's child. Tell you consider Stephanie's child as your own. Ask to marry due to child together. Oh my God, you could do plenty of shit, but we ain't doing that. We're going to tell her that we're going to consider the child as your own. And we're going to see what her response is to that. Yeah, I know it's cold outside, y'all, but we're going to do this real quick. 
She's happy about that. Okay. Father known. The father of Stephanie's child. The father of Stephanie's child reacted very poorly to the results of the test. Oh my God. She knows. A family accepted. The biological father of Stephanie's latest child accepted to consider the child as their own. Okay, that's good. That's good for her, I guess. But he's still uneasy about it. <laughs> Accepting another Sims child as his own has given him too much happiness, happiness to not feel happy too. Okay, so enough chit chat, y'all. Yeah, you can go ahead and head on home. We're going to have Jerome go inside the house. Because, yeah, he had a stressful morning, but <laughs> it is what it is. You have to lay in that bed that you made, sir. So this is where we're going to go ahead in this part. I hope y'all enjoyed. <laughs> I really hope y'all enjoyed this episode. Let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. I am going to try to be as consistent as possible with y'all. Once I stop working this overtime, nigga, we're going to be in there. Like, I'm trying to do this 24-hour stream. I'm trying to do this giveaway. In the next episode, we're going to be going to church with them and possibly going to work with some money. So... Y'all tune in. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please like this video. And I will see y'all in the next one.